The next type of object that you can insert inside of Microsoft Excel is a shape. Now there's all sorts of shapes. You've got basic shapes like ovals, rectangles, uh, triangles, all sorts of them. And then you got some more complex shapes. Things like arrows, block arrows, smiley faces. There's a little smiley face icon in there. But you got all sorts of shapes that you can then add into your Excel worksheets. Now, for me personally, I like formatting. I like changing colors. I like things to pop out. We don't want to go overboard on the formatting to make everything formatted, right? Because then it's kind of hard to tell really what you want the user to look at. This is really where a shape comes into play. We want to use shapes to help add to the content, add to the message, right? We don't want to go overboard with them because then it's just all over the place, but add to it. As an example, I'm going to use a block arrow just to draw attention to this 59.7%, right? That's more than half my monthly budget spent away on rent. So I want to point that out and say, what? look at that number right there, right? And just get that little block arrow to point to it. So inserting a shape, super simple to do. Take a look. I'm going to go to my insert tab, back to the illustration section. We saw this earlier and we've got shapes. So I'll give shapes a click. Got all sorts of shapes to pull from. You got the basic shapes, you got block arrows, you got equation shapes, all sorts of little goodies in there for you to use. Now for me personally, I'm gonna to go to block arrows. I'm gonna grab the second little block arrow, the arrow to the left. I'll give that a click. I'm gonna hop over here just next to the 59%. I'm gonna left click and drag just to create that shape. I can move it around, get that thing to point right there. Right, just to draw attention to it. There's my shape. Whoop. What are we looking at? 50, 59%? What? Right? <laughs> Let's draw attention to it. Okay? Try this out. Like I said, really simple to do. Insert shapes. You got a load of them to pull from. Right? You could use the arrow. You could try something else like the little smiley face there. I like the smiley face. Maybe I'll put a smiley face over here too. There we go. I'm going to change the color of that guy so it doesn't blend into that background. But we'll take a look at that next. So first... Throw a shape in there, throw two shapes in there, right? Try it out. An arrow, a smiley face, whatever you want to try.